Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Cyrus Lorbrook. To today's video, you already know what time it is, man. It's time for a Lord talk. Sunny Digital. Sunny Rolling Grounds of West. Today, guys, we are about eight days away, or either eight or seven days away from the launch of WWE 2K23. Now, all my 2K fans watching this, I hope that you guys are keeping your expectations not high. I hope they're not high. Keep your expectations either in the middle or keep them low. Because at the end of the day, we all saw, man, WWE 2K22 23 is basically an upgraded version of 22 with roster change with roster improvements and attire changes. Let's be real, guys. I honestly don't think there's going to really be much new about this game. I'm joined by my boys Pastel, Andrew, and Hunter. We're about to go into this DLC pack list and we're about to talk about everything. Let's get into it, man. First, first pack is the Steiner Row Pack. With the Steiner brothers, B Fab being a manager only, and the rest of Hit Row. Okay, so one thing we need to know about the Steiner brothers: we are not getting Big Papa Pump Scott Steiner. B Fab, I have no problem with her being in the game, but why does she take up a playable character slot? That that should like I feel like they should add one more character to this pack. Cause I mean, like I'm glad B Fab got added. But it kind of sucks we're getting a manager in place of, you know, a playable character. Yeah. Well. I agree with that part. Like, that's the equivalent of having Paul Heyman as DLC. Like, nobody wants that. Well, you like, know, people are gonna... Be in the base fucking game. You know... Be in the base game. You know that people are gonna glitch her. They're gonna glitch her into being a yeah, regular superstar. But, and I also have something to add before we get any further. 2K has originally said that they intentionally held people back for DLC. Well, what that possibly could mean is like some of the single stars got held up or, you know, they were originally going to add top dollar at, in the base game and add everyone as DLC, but they figured, you know, let's just hold them back for the DLC so they come out all together. Yeah. But um, overall first pack, decent. Decent pack. I'll give him that. Like, Hit Row deserves to be in the game, and so do the Steiner brothers. Those, yeah. those I'm, I'm happy with. I can agree with that. It's just kind of sucks we aren't getting Papa Pump uh, Steiner, and we aren't getting a playable character. Like, we're getting four playable characters instead of five. Yeah. So are we moving on to pack two now? Yes. The uh, okay. pretty sweet pack. Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows, perfect, perfect. I don't, perfect. yeah, I don't mind that. I like that. Tiffany Stratton, I don't really have an opinion on because I don't, I'm not too familiar with who that is. I haven't watched NXT 2.0 at all. Me um, neither. Yeah, I barely watched that. Opinion. She um, deserves to be in. She's not bad. Because um, I, because from what I've seen, a lot of people are happy she's in there. Um, who the fuck is Elton Prince? That's, that's one of the. That's um pretty deadly oh shit um, oh okay. elton and kit that's pretty deadly yeah oh okay never mind this pack is perfect yeah that's a good pack yeah, that's pretty cool. that really is a pretty sweet pack um race to nxt harley race why is he in the nxt pack yeah that, i don't know why he's in the nxt pack <laughs> I just realized why the audio is so long. Um, Ivy Nile. Who was that again? She was also in the Watch. Oh. oh. I my. don't. I, I don't know who that is. Look her up. My fault for the audio being. God damn. Why does it always turn it down? Alright. Wendy Chu is a W. 
Yeah. Yeah. Tony D'Angelo, right, though. This man hasn't been on TV in months. Has oh, he? her? He has, though. He has? Yeah, he was in a feud. I don't remember who he was in a feud with, but he's been in a feud with someone lately. I literally don't even... I haven't heard shit about him being on TV, bro. Yeah, Ivy Nile, I don't know about her, to be honest. I, I don't know. Know. Who is Ivy I feel Nile? like... Uh, the, the girl big... from Diamond Mine. Oh, yeah. Diamond oh no, she's, that she's make good. That would sense. She's good. Yeah. She's good. Um, Wendy Chu... W. That was a guarantee. And like, Trick Williams no. is definitely the biggest W. Tony, no, no, no. I'm going to say he isn't a W because he should have just been in the base game. Trick he Williams? literally should have been in the base game. He should have if Carmelo was in there, but I it's, don't know. Which, 2K, that's, that's he's doing the 2K one thing. I'm thinking they intentionally held back. Mm -hmm. That's the one I'm... Because, like, there's no reason he should be DLC, to be honest. Uh, Tony D'Angelo, I guess... I mean, um, I've, okay, I've Bray been Wyatt, this great Bray Wyatt is definitely the best one in these packs. Then we got we all that's an entire pack. Then and, we got Zeus. But right next to it, Zeus. Which, okay, none of you guys really know, but this is more my expertise. Zeus has no reason to be in these games. Like, at all. He's from a failed wrestling movie. And the only reason he's in this fucking thing is because he faced Hulk Hogan twice. Ever. Dumb. I don't even know who the fuck this oh. guy is. But. I just you searched him up. I, I only remember him because of the movie. Because I just looked him up. Because <laughs> there, there is another way you guys might remember him. He was in Friday. He played Devo. Yeah, yeah that's the only reason I remember him. Because I saw him in Friday. Yeah, okay. Which is Zeus. Oh. Is Valhalla. Sarah that's... Logan. I don't know why she's... She hasn't I... wrestled ever since she returned. She's yeah, just I, been a I, manager. I want to say she deserves to be in this game, but I don't she, think she should be DLC. She should have I been really in the base game as a manager, and we should have had something else in this pack. No, I feel like she she should have been in the base game, but I don't think as a manager. I feel like people would get a little annoyed if she wasn't playable. Well, she hasn't wrestled yeah. since she returned, so I mean... I think she did. I think she had like one match. No. Was she in the Rumble as well? No. She, was she... No, she wasn't even in the Rumble. Yeah, she was in the Rumble. Not this year, but the year before. But not she as Valhalla. Last year. No, not as Valhalla. Yeah, so she wasn't in this year. Um, Ever since she returned as Valhalla, she has not wrestled. Yeah, I don't I really was, care for her. I feel like she did once, though. No, I don't know. Because She's don't only know. been a manager. Uh, I've looked it up. Okay. Uh, Joe Gacy, yes. Yeah, he deserves to be in. Uh, Blair Davenport, I don't know who the fuck that is. That's um, Bea Priestley. Who? Bea Priestley. That's, Wait, uh, didn't, it, didn't she Ospreay's get released? Girlfriend. No, I don't think so. She's just not been uh, active because... I'm guess, looking up. Okay. I'm looking her, her up. Her last match was against Indy Hartwell in August last year. She might have been released, but... I don't Damn. know. Dad, she's been injured, maybe? She still has WWE on her Instagram handle. So. Yeah, she still has NXT in her profile. Who the hell? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I've never seen her in my life. She's yeah. pretty good. She's actually a really good wrestler. Okay, pack five, Eve Torres. Yeah. Bad news, you pack Wade Barrett and the entirety of Chase U and Eve Torres. And Eve Torres. Which, Eve Torres, W. Um, Wade Barrett, it, it looks like it's going to be core Wade Barrett. Core Nexus. Like, early yeah. Barrett. It's not going to be bad news. Which, I'm going to be honest, if he if he has a Nexus theme, it's a, it's like the biggest W of them all. I don't know if he liked the bad news Barrett theme, but... I don't think they're going to do that. Um, but Chase U, yes. So, overall, this... These DLCs are mid. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. I'm only hyped for the last two packs. That's really it. Exactly. And I mean, OC is cool and all, but it's not like a hype but to them. Here's the problem. I feel like this wouldn't be so hated if we didn't get the teaser image. Oh, yeah. Because like, if you pull up the teaser image like right now, there are several names that are just 
not here. Yeah. Like Carlito, the biggest one. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna say I'm kind of pissed that like as much as I love that they put Joe Gacy in the game. I'm low-key pissed that they snuffed out the Grizzled Young Veterans again, which are his, like, they're uh, tagging with him in the faction schism. Honestly? Um, they're, the, like, I'm, the acolyte. Thing. What I'm hoping is that this isn't everything. Because yeah. I'm hoping they do what they yeah, did. Yeah, I don't think it is everything. Ronda Rousey last minute and just reveal, oh, yeah, we, we're adding more. Because, um, like, if you compare this, to last year's season pass. This is a... Like, this is a fucking disappointment. Like, last year's season pass was phenomenal. We got so many names that have been asked to come back for years. Like, Boogeyman, Umaga, Yokozuna, fucking, uh... Uh, who else? There was... Now Umaga's a big thing. Hurricane is the big one. We got... And then we got some new names like Dragonov, A Kid, Zaya Lee, which I don't care, was a pretty good addition. Um, Wesley and the the one that we almost got, Nash Carter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, like overall, last season pass was in was incredible. Probably one of the best like DLCs and games in the WWE game that we've had in a long time. Yeah, yeah, let's look at this. Like, that is definitely Carlito upside Where? down, is it? Huh? Where? Uh, right next to newspaper, flip it upside down. That's that's definitely Carlito. I don't think that says Carlito. Car I don't know what that says. I because yeah, I don't. You were wrong this whole time. That's not an O. I mean. I don't know what that is. It looks like it says caring. Also, if anyone out there can create a Slapjack or Shane oh Thorne, I will God. appreciate you. That, I appreciate bro. you so much. Nobody's going to do that. Please. I will pay good money. No, I'm kidding. I won't pay, but I'll download it and I'll give it a thumbs up. You heard up. that. He's going to pay you 20 bucks if you do it. If you if you make one, I will I will give you all the praise in the world. Is I will use that motherfucker nonstop. In it, and as in praise, he means twenty bucks. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, but yeah, overall, just, eh. I'm desperate. <clears throat> I want Slapjack back. Yeah, we gonna <laughs> like, end the video before he starts crying about Slapjack. <laughs> <We> Slapjack. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for watching the video, man. Comment down below what you think about the DLC pack and what your thoughts are about it. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Hit the bell to so you're notified for every upload. I'm going to catch you on the next video, man. Peace. Make Slapjack. No. My mama kill me if she goes and been smoking a cigarette. Yeah!